Alright everybody, welcome back to some more Roboco. Today we're playing Silicon Sonata. If music be the food of love, play the cello for a truly romantic dinner. So our main objective is just to play the cello to accompany the violin, follow all the violin bot's prompts, and keep the cello upright for a pleasing sound. Ooh. Ooh, such a romantic dinner. I see the box of chocolates. I immediately think that's a secret or something. Look at those big old steaks, too. Something tells me this is gonna be a complicated challenge. What is that, too? The main objective? Play the cello to accompany the violin? There's like little things. I gotta play it on time, on rhythm. I need rhythm. Okay, so I see the cello. I see the stand that I can rest the cello in. I see the thing to play the cello. There's the violin bot. There's a secret that I can't exactly read. There's another secret back there that I can't exactly read. Oh, look at the look at the little fridge magnets. There's even a pie in the oven. I'm somehow in the oven. There's another secret that I can't read. Okay, so I found quite a few secrets pretty quick. What's around back? In case of romantic dinner, do not break the glass. Instead, gently lift the lid and slide the dial down. Oh, <laughs> okay. Don't break the glass. Wait, wait, wait. So that's a... Is that that's just a dimmer switch for the lights? You got normal, romantic, and creepy. Ah, <laughs> uh, this game's too adorable. Ah, uh, there's a secret that I can read. What does it say? Put salt or pepper on both steaks. Oh, 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 there's also another secret back there that I can't really read. What is this? Fire? Why, why are you giving me fire? But I'm guessing this conveyor belt is going to be moving and you can just stop it for an item. So I think no matter what, yeah, I can't, I can't, I can't go read that secret. I think no matter what, I'm going to need a claw that's able to move around, lift a cello, lift the thing over there. I think the main objectives are pretty simple. I have no idea how complicated those secrets are going to get, but uh, we'll just focus. Focus on what I'm supposed to do. Okay, so this is my first design. I know that the claws are pretty expensive, so instead of going with pistons, I decided to go with elevators in three dimensions. Uh, it doesn't exactly give me any special angles to work with with the claw, but I should be able to do just a simple driving robot. I should be able to do everything that I need to do. I think I made these motors kind of slow. All right, let's fix that. Okay, what uh, wh what's the speed like now? Good, good. Good. Let's see, let's hope that I can actually lift the, the cello. I gotta lift that cello. I might have to build it uh, bigger, longer, faster, harder. Or, or I don't even need to do that. Oh my god, cello, what are you doing? I really tried to make my robot cheap. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> okay, relax. <laughs> relax there. Oh my god. Stop moving the cello. Alright, pick it up. Okay, okay, no, 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 no. Come on, crane. Just turn the darn robot. Oh my god, it's because my robot, all the weight is like over there off to the side, so turning does not work for me. Okay, there we go, there we go, there we go. Right on top of the cello. I've got it. <laughs> I'm about to stab this guy. Don't... Oh, the, the, the lamp terrified me. I thought I was going to break. I'm about to stab this guy with a cello. All right, let's bring that... Uh, oh. Uh-oh. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's bring that center of mass closer to my robot and the bottom of my robot so now I can actually drive around with some control. Oh, my God. Stop knocking into stuff. All right, so my plan, <laughs> my plan here, first of all, is to get this cello case out of the way. Anyway, I didn't want to go with pistons because uh, pistons are much more expensive than elevators, but now that I'm looking at these elevators, they got rods sticking out all over the place. Oh, there we go, there we go. Hey, what are you guys talking about? Oh, so dressed so nicely too for the occasion. 
What a lovely romantic dinner. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do this, to be honest. But I'm looking at my robot design and I'm really thinking, uh, I should have probably should have probably gone with the pistons. Or just a just a engine, to be honest. A mechanical arm that can lift stuff. Can I push that out any farther? Yeah, there you go. Alright. Moment of truth. Drop the cello. How did I miss? Ugh. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay. Bring that in, bring that down. Let's line myself up a little bit better with the cello. This is one challenge that I will not be speedrunning. I don't necessarily have to keep the cello upright, right? Oh ho ho! All right, all right, I think I can go with that. That's pretty pretty much in there. I might even be able to, you know what? I, I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna try to nudge and adjust it. Give me a little nudgy nudge. Nudgy nudge nudge. Nut. Maybe I just grab it. Yes. No. <laughs> I had it. No. Ugh. Okay. Yeah. No. So I gotta. I gotta do something about. There's no. I'm just making it so much worse. All right. All right. I gotta do some. I gotta figure out something with this. Oh, oh, I saw the secret on that conveyor belt. You know what? I'm not getting distracted, though. No distractions for me. Okay, I don't wanna, I don't wanna, like, break anything. I'm gonna use this, um, I'm gonna use this yellow bar over here. Okay, okay. The plan is I lower this onto the bar. It tips over, and I catch it. You know, that's that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Kind of where we were before. I probably would be making more progress just starting over. Alright, Jello. Pay no attention to me, humans. I'm just uh, doing what you program me to. Yes! Oh, that is a perfect Jello. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Now, now I can do whatever I want. But the plan was to uh, make use of this horizontal motion to play the cello so let's get uh, let's get that thing get hold on hold on how do I do this I gotta position myself oh the plant don't don't start oh my god oh my god these rods okay here we go I've got it there we go, there we go. I'm trying to play, I swear. Oh my god, how do you play the cello? Yes! Oh, the humans are in love. What a romantic song. Now I'm gonna steal your steak. <laughs> Took me quite a while to get it, but uh, I was stubborn. I, I just gotta get all three of those objectives. I'm really loving these challenges. Man, they're creative. I, I'm also very, okay, the timer is not going. I don't wanna get any uh, property damage though. Oh, I'm curious about those secrets. I wanna go read that secret though. Come on, come on, come on, let me go read it. Let me go read it. What does it say? I, I, I tried to read it upside down. When the secret comes around, I'll be pushing the bouton. The bouton. And push the bouton. There you go, there you go. What does it say? Place a lit red candle upright on the table. Ah, and there's a red candle all over the place here. And that's why there's fire. Okay, it's starting to make sense. But we'll have to come back to these stages. Uh, to get all of these secrets. There's still five secrets in here somewhere. I just gotta find them all. And I didn't get 8,000 points. Darn!
But hey, five bits is still pretty good. I think I did really well with the cost of my robot, but yeah, the time that I took, way too long. Bing, 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 bing. I'm loving Roboco, and I hope that you guys are too. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. I love to read your comments. Leave a like and subscribe for some more Roboco videos because next time we're gonna be checking out Across the Goo. Eww, don't touch the goo. But that's it for today's Roboco video, folks. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.